But if you're in a place right now where, you know, you hear me talking about, you know, selling this many policies and doing this and that, uh, and you're looking at your life and you're looking at your uh, career, your current situation, and you're like, man, I'm just stuck. Um, you know, I don't, I don't feel like I'm going anywhere. You know, I'm not where I want to be. I'm not um, excelling at where I'm at. I, I, I hate my job. Like, I don't like what I'm doing right now. I can't find something to get passionate about. I can't find, you know, my, uh, you know, what the career that was made for me. Uh, yeah, I'm, I've failed at this. I've failed at this. I've failed at this. Uh, I just wanted to offer up some encouragement to you uh, because I understand uh, what that feels like. What insurance space do you prefer? You know, so I, I like within the insurance space, I like, you know, life insurance, uh, specifically if you can offer something with um, living benefits. Um, our company has done extremely well in the life insurance space. Um, just so you know, by the way, we are recruiting actively uh, insurance agents for our company. So if that's an opportunity that you'd be uh, interested in, you know, certainly shoot me a DM and I'll point you in the right direction. Uh, here's the thing too. You have to, you have to, to figure out like, who do you want to work with? Who do you want to spend your time with? And not to sound uh, insensitive, but do you want to work with old people or do you want to work with younger people? Medicare is going to be old people, right? Like, do you want to work with old people all the time? Do you have a skill in communicating with older individuals? Um, but do you enjoy it? That's the thing about your career and work. This stuff is way more serious than people take it. It's a third of your life, at least. And if you're going to spend a third of your life doing something, you might as well enjoy it. If you're going to spend a third of your life with a particular demographic of people, you might as well like those people. You get to choose who you want to work with. So, like, why not work with the kind of people that you just enjoy being around? Maybe it would make life more enjoyable if the people that you worked with every single day you actually liked. What a thought. So just think about that. Like that's probably the best group that you should work with. Like so again, if you're a real estate agent, when you're going out on on calls with potential clients, when you're going to look at houses, when you're doing an open house, and you have those certain people that walk in the door that you're like, oh, thank God, it's one of them. Versus when you have certain people that walk in the door and you're like, oh, bleh, get these people out of here like as quickly as possible. Who are those people that you just genuinely love being around? That you genuinely love working with? Um, that's who you need to build your systems around. That's what's going to bring fulfillment in your life because you're working with the people that you want to work with and you're creating a system around it to be able to work with more of them. And it's just an enjoyable way to go about your life. You want to talk about quality life? Work incredibly hard all day with people you love being around and make an incredible living. That's fulfillment. Well, so if you like doing business with older people, if you like doing business uh, in that demographic, then I think that's great for you. And that's something that you can get passionate about. If you don't, you don't. Uh, I think you need to be honest with yourself and not look at the money. Quit looking at these, like your question is very, very focused, I think probably on the money, which is the best opportunity, which is more lucrative, which are you going to enjoy more? Because I can promise you whichever opportunity you're going to enjoy more is going to become the most lucrative. Uh, because you're going to be able to go all in. You're going to be able to enjoy it. You're going to be able to persist uh, on the days that you don't feel like doing stuff. Um, that's going to be the best opportunity for you. So I think it's a, a more important perspective.